The four-month eruption of Kilauea volcano on Hawaii Island is ongoing, and scientists recently shared new video taken during a survey of the active summit region. From the eastern rim of the crater, geologists with the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory captured these close views of the lava activity, which remains confined to the summit caldera. Lava is still erupting from a vent on the northwest side of the crater, supplying a lava lake that continues to slowly grow deeper. The active fissure is building a spatter cone that now stands approximately 15 meters or 49 feet above the lava lake surface. A lava tube appears to wrap around the spatter cone, feeding the inlet to the lake. As of April 22nd, the lava lake was 226 meters or 741 feet deep and remains stagnant over its eastern half. This time-lapse video shows how lava circulation and intermittent foundering of the crust continues in the western portion of the lava lake, oozing out every so often along the perimeter. The most recent sulfur dioxide emission rate measured on April 14th was 950 tons per day, which is elevated compared to rates in the months before the eruption started in December 2020. Another time-lapse video recorded far from the crater shows a typical day for the summit plume, as it is being carried to the southwest by the trade winds. Geologists also captured a view of the crater by helicopter. The imagery that was collected during the flight was used to produce this thermal map. Active surface lava that is largely limited to the western side of the lake can be seen in red. The cooler, solidified portion of the lake is seen in blue. The stagnant portion of the lava lake is slowly growing westward. Summit tilt meters recorded minor change over the past 24 hours. Seismicity remains stable, with elevated tremor. Scientists say there is no unusual activity beyond the summit on the East Rift Zone. Monitors indicate that the summit and Upper East Rift Zone is refilling with magma at rates similar to those measured over the past two years.